Yes. I remember the with the old ten clock too. It used to strike all through the night because it was nice for those who couldn't sleep to hear it. But then some said it kept them awake, didn't it? And then they stopped it as from ten o'clock till six o'clock for striking. Morning, yeah. And that was old Mr. Clements that had the jewellery mm. shop, as we call and it, and the at dad, he helped him. He used to wind it up, yeah. Wind how long ago did the the potters took the pot about and was so long? It's still there. I think the bell is still there, They're George. Still there, just yeah, it rings it Friday morning after yeah, Tutty right, Day, but we were down there. Yeah. That was how they called the fire fire brigade. Yes. Yeah, that fun old bell. Yes. Mm. Yeah, yeah. there. Any fire that would ring the old fire bell. But yeah, <laughs> we used to stand there and watch them come with the old churchill thing. And then with all the other noise of these days, they wouldn't hear it. No, they yeah. wouldn't. That's true. Well, I don't know. That that fire bell used to rattle out quite a bit. Yeah, but with not with the lost spots going on now. We have helicopters over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the time, just true. I know what he used to ring to. We had time. He used to get get out and go off. Don't see where the poor was. But it was on on emphasising on the word was a very interesting town, wasn't it? It was a real rural market. Yes. Oh yes. It was everybody's town, friendly town. But now it's. Did any of you belong to any organisations like this? Youth Council Silver Thread we go to, that's all. No, oh, darling, when you were younger, we you? Oh, I beg your pardon. Yes, Christian Endeavour, what Miss yeah. Gosling used to run. Yeah. The Girls' Friendly Society that Miss Franks used to run. And of course, we were very... Um, Did you go to the Girls' Club, which... No, um, no. Girls' Friendly Society. Dolly Waddington and... Uh, no, no, oh. no, 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 no. And, um, of course, then the most of the time of the Sunday, we were spent in the chapel. We used to have to go to service in the morning, so just go in the afternoon, so and then service in the evening. Three mm. times a Sunday. Mm. Yeah. I've been under the guide. They used to call the Methodist Chapel the Eat Wells Chapel. That's our mm. Christian error. Who was the guy who the Marjorie Platt. Now the Platts lived in the Priory. Really? No, they lived in the Priory. They might have owned the Priory, yes, yes. but they lived in the Priory yes. up here. Yes. This, yes. all this was yes. their, their estate. Their estate. Yes. Oh, right. I was named after her. Trees and woods. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yes, Jane Mason Yeah. Yes, that's right. And uh, then there was the girls' club, which was run by a couple of the school teachers. We used to have to do an hour's sewing, and then we had an hour's recreation. And of course, the recreation consisted quite a lot of dancing, mm. and Joe so it used to get roped into the piano. <laughs> with um, the Nichols. Gwen Nichol was um, assistant guide and Margaret was the chief guide. Yeah. Yes. But were you in it? Just yeah, sure you I was. Were in it, yeah. yeah, I joined when That's I was about 11. I left when I was 17 and a half. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. uh, I, I was mixed up with guides in guiding the bars over the years. I knew Nichols. Mm. Mr. McCubbin, she was also Oh yes, yeah. Betty was um, mm. captain as well. Yeah. Yeah. And I. Yes. Mm -hmm. And um, you went in the WI and things like no, that? No, no. I was when I was 18. <laughs> I didn't have time. Uh, I used uh, to have to uh, do uh, work in that part. And that was only because my I mother went was to in school. Them. I belonged to the LDV. I used to have to do work when I came out of school. I was in the LDV. Looked up and vanished. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I was in yeah, there. Yeah, that's all me. Uh, in, in the auxiliary forest sort of it, and then on the, on the farm. Uh-huh. Mm. Well, now, anything else? Because my dad was the, um, the chief guide. He was an ordinary farm, and then he was an eating farm, and then he was part to station officer. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the fire service played a great part in, in Huntley. In Huntley, yes. Mm. So did the Conservative Association. Really? Mm. Doesn't anymore? No, no. Why do you think that is? Goodness knows. I was talking to um, Mr. Duffel, who's chairman of the Conservatives. Oh yes. And he's fed up. He said he can't get any support. Nobody's interested. And nobody's a Conservative. So uh, it's interesting. Uh, yes. Well, well, we we had wish so drives in the corn exchange oh, yeah. every week, sometimes twice a week. Um, and they were organised by either the Conservative Association or the Fire Brigade, 
or come on Marjorie, we'll go to the association's help. Um, oh, I don't know, that's a long time ago. Yes dear, I know it is. <laughs> and they used to have that balls, um, yeah. um, Christmas time, and harvest yeah. time. In the church house, I should think every week, without fail, there was either a social event or um, a dance or some organisation's amusement. Mm. Yeah, yes, it has. Yes, it has. Mm. Yeah. have dances in, in the town hall, didn't yeah. they? Yeah. Yeah. You'd have a cinema in the town hall. Yeah. Oh yes, we yes. had a cinema on the town hall three nights. Oh yes, yeah. yeah. Friday and Saturday. Yeah. When we were a child, matinee. He was going Saturday Matinee's afternoon matinee. Full of pictures. And it wasn't. Um, yeah, and it didn't have the music. Miss Bell, that used to live in Hungary, she used to play the piano. Ivy Giles before her. Who? Ivy Giles Oh, well, I only her. know Miss Bell when mm. I was a kid. But All those Tom Mix cowboys. That's yes. right. Yeah. When the villain was coming, she used to bang it down. And we used to hiss him, you know. And then when it was lovely dovey, she used to play nice, quiet music. And <coughs> yeah, we used to go in for yeah, thruppence. Uh, they used to have a market in there with chicken and rabbit and things, you know, <coughs> yes. And then when they had the cinema, the people was in there started killing them like this and so on. The <laughs> bloody chicken been in here again. <laughs> yes, it was a totally different way of life. It was. Yeah. Yes, yeah. it was. Yeah. And of course, I mean, as far as the school children were concerned, there was no transport. You walked to school. Mm. Children used to come in from Stanton and Vils. Oh, well, that was nothing. Down and back for lunch at Eddington. Joe <laughs> um, Foliot. Well, um, what's her name? Ha! She lives in Canal Walk. Her father was a farmer out at. What's her name? What's it new? Got you stamped. Her father Got was you a farmer. stamped. Her, farmer, her father was a farmer out at um, Chilton. Foliot. That farm that goes out towards um, Mavis, not Mavis, not Mavis, no, not Mavistock. The Mavistocks followed them. Oh, no, King. no, not Kings. Oh, she won't be stumped. <laughs> Richards' private school from Chilton Fairly yet. Sometimes she got a lift back with the milk cart, mm -hmm. sometimes she didn't. Mm -hmm. Well, even if children wanted to walk today, you couldn't let them because they yeah, were so not safe. No, they're not safe. Yeah. Well, you can't trust them on the road today, yes. can you? Children from Leverton, they used to come here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there were no yeah. school meals provided. You had to start, you brought your own lunch. Mm -hmm. So, 